This video demonstrates basic searching in the PubMed database. To get to PubMed, go to the library's website, choose Resources and then Databases, and that will bring you to our Databases page. Then you can click on PubMed here at the top, or click on the Medicine Topic area and scroll down until you see PubMed. When you navigate to PubMed using one of the links on the library's website, PubMed will automatically detect that you're affiliated with the University of St. Augustine and show you our specialized full text links. Now here in PubMed, let's do a search for elderly stroke virtual reality rehabilitation. This is a good way to search in PubMed a string of keywords, no punctuation, no Boolean operators like and or or, just a string of key concepts. And then we'll click search. You can see our list of results here. You can narrow these results or filter them using the filters on the left side of the screen. We have quite a few options. You can filter by article type. You can filter by publication date. There's also additional filters you can add. If you click on additional filters, um, you can add more options of article types uh, other than just the ones that are the, the default. Species, subject, age, language is one that's particularly useful and it's good to have that one show on your PubMed. So you click language and you can check mark any of the languages that you speak um, or read and then click show and that will show up here on the side. So to apply the filters, we click on them. Let's say we want to filter our results by publications within the last five years and publications in English. You can see that that narrowed our results uh, by quite a bit. You can see that what filters have been applied and you can clear them here as well. I do want to note that there is a text availability filter here. We don't recommend using that because it actually limits you too much. Keep in mind that PubMed is a free public database. So some people who use PubMed might not be affiliated with a library and then they only really want full text, maybe that they can access for free from open access journals, or they wanna see full text links from PubMed to the publisher site where they can choose to purchase the article. With your library affiliation, you have access to more articles than are listed as free full text or full text in PubMed, which I'll show you in just a moment. If we click on one of our results here, you can see more information, the abstract information about the article itself, as well as some other options listed down here under page navigation. To go to the next result, you can click the arrow and you can go through your list of results this way without going back to that main search results page. Now to access the full text of an article through PubMed in the University of St. Augustine Library Holdings, you want to look for this University of St. Augustine Library full text access button. You can click this and it'll take you to a landing page with information about the article and we'll give you links. Uh, if the library provides access to that article, it'll give you a link to click on to go to the article's full text. If it's not an article the library provides immediate online access to, it'll give you a link here to an interlibrary loan form where you can request that article and the library staff will uh, acquire it for you through one of our partner libraries. If you have questions about this or any other library questions, please email library at usa.edu.